What's up everyone, in today's video I'll be reviewing the latest version of Android, Android 5.0.1 Lollipop. Google has made a great OS, but there are some major cons which I'll go through in this video. So anyway, my name is Ben, and if you're new here, be sure to subscribe, but without further ado, let's jump straight into this video. Let's start with the lock screen. On the top you have a status bar with your carrier on the left, and a signal and a battery on the right along with your profile picture. In the middle of the screen you have your clock and date, and if you have any notifications they appear below the clock. If you want to unlock the, the phone you swipe up from the bottom, which I really liked. I'm also a big fan that you can go to your calls if you swipe from the left corner, and open your camera if you swipe from the right corner. The homepage is really customizable, which is what Android is known for, but I still hate the fact that you can't move or remove the Google search bar, and that it has to be on every single page. It just takes too much space, but then again it's nice that it's always accessible. The app drawer works quite nice and fast, but the background is now white rather than being black like it was on 4.4. One thing that I loved about Android L is the material design. It makes the OS look amazing and it works quite good if you don't have a billion apps open in the background. And since we're already talking about the apps in the background, in my opinion, Android L is slowing the device down. I can't believe I'm saying this, but it's true. My device was fa way faster on 4.4 KitKat, and to be honest, I'm still thinking of downgrading back to 4.4. Another thing is the slow boot up that I had to deal with when I powered my phone on. It literally took ages for the phone to boot up, which got quite annoying. Another thing is the battery saver. While it's quite awesome, it slows down your device so much that it, can it sometimes becomes unusable. It lags like crazy, apps crash and don't even get me started with the random reboots. So here's what I think. The Android 5.0 Lollipop has some incredible features like the battery saver, material design and the others, but a lot more work is needed till they start working perfectly, because in my opinion everything has to be working 100% right and correctly before a company can release a new version of software, and that wasn't the case with Android L. In fact, I feel like Google tried to push it out as fast as possible, which is why we have so many bugs. I have to reset my phone almost every single day so I can use it. Apps crash all the time, even system UI pops in the multitasking drawer, which is quite funny, but I'm not kidding. At first, I also thought that there is something wrong with my phone, but I went on Reddit and noticed that there are many other people with the same issues. So yeah, I'm probably going to go back to Android 4.4 and come back to Android Lollipop in a few months when Google hopefully fixes all the bugs, but till then I'm going to be enjoying the stability of Android 4.4. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching, don't forget to like, comment below with your thoughts and your experience, and be sure to subscribe for more high quality Android content.